Officials in multiple states are grappling with a sudden spike in heroin overdoses, and they think it's being caused by a dealer or dealers who are lacing the drug with an elephant tranquilizer. In Ohio, there have been nearly 90 ODs in the last week, along with 12 in Indiana. And last week in West Virginia, 27 people overdosed within a four hour period. One official is there saying that the amount of 911 calls are pouring in as though this were a mass casualty event. Some people are even using Facebook to warn users about the deadly batch. I want to bring in CNN's chief medical correspondent, Sanjay Gupta, who's joining me live now. I, I just can't believe that an elephant tranquilizer would be an additive in a drug. It's called carfentanil. Am I pronouncing it right? Yep. Car carfentanil. A lot of people have heard of fentanyl. Mm -hmm. uh, the, these, are, you know, actually, these are all part of the same active ingredient. They're all they all come from opium, essentially. Whether it be the pills, the the hydrocodones, whether it be things like morphine, whether it be heroin or fentanyl. And, and that's part of the problem, is that uh, people switch back and forth from these things. If you're trying pain pills, you can no longer get those, you may switch to heroin. What's happening now, and has happened before, is that these heroin dealers are cutting it. They're essentially adding these other substances to the heroin, trying to give a, a longer, stronger high, but also to stretch out their supply. In this case, as you mentioned, probably a couple of dealers doing this, adding this carfentanil, to try and really push it to the limits because as you mentioned, this is typically something not used on humans, used only commercially and can tranquilize very large animals, even elephants. So it, it, is, it is crazy what is happening out there with regard to this cutting of heroin. It's been happening for a long time, but this is unprecedented, the, the, the yeah. strength of the ingredients they're using.